Hey y'all, so I have a huge haul, and I mean huge. Like this box is full, I've got crap in my seat. Not literal crap, but stuff I'm gonna show you in my seat. I have so much. I went crazy recently ordering stuff online. I was so excited ordering stuff for my giveaway, which if you haven't entered, make sure you have, links down below. But I just went a little crazy. Like I saw all this stuff, I was like, I have to have it. So. I figured I would show you all my new goodies. This is probably gonna be a 30 minute long video, so sit back and grab a cup of coffee. First things first, I got this. This is the Lorac Mega Pro 2 palette. I'm not gonna go into much detail because I already have a review in, I think my tutorial's up by now, um, using this. So yes, I grabbed this, love it, highly recommend it. Everyone needs it. Then I also got the new Becca Afterglow palette. This came out for um, the holiday 2015. It's beautiful. Here's the packaging. And this is a great opportunity if you, whoop, there goes a little plastic, um, to try Becca products if you've never tried them or have all your favorites in one palette. You get um, Moonstone, Rose Gold, Topaz, Wild Honey, and Flower Child. Amazing, amazing, amazing. As you can see, I've already swatched them all. So I got that. Then, I got a Lorac Pro palette. I already have one of these. This is my second one. Everyone needs a Lorac Pro palette. They're amazing, amazing, amazing. I mean, it's just, you have to have it. Um, but there's the shades there. Like I said, this is my second one, so obviously I highly recommend it. So I grabbed me another one. All right, then I got, I got this Tarte. This is the Rainforest After Dark palette, and this has six clay eyeshadows in exclusive shades. Colored clay blush in the shade Unleashed, a clay bronzer in Park Avenue Princess, and a clay highlighter in Champagne. Now you guys, the main reason I got this is I recently went on vacation and I quickly discovered, this is it, how cute is this packaging? I recently discovered that I needed like an all-in-one because I had my eyeshadow palette, I had blush, I had highlight, I had my contour, I had my bronzer. It was enough. So I got this. This has everything, little plastic, it has everything you need all in one. You've got your beautiful eyeshadows there, your blush in the middle, highlight, and your bronzer. This is so easy, the quality is amazing. You can just throw this in your travel bag and your purse and you're good to go. The only thing I don't like about this is the shades are only on the little plastic thing that covers it, so I feel like I need to keep this so I know what shades they are. So again, that's the only way you know you can tell what the shades are. That's the only downside, but amazing quality, amazing product, love this. Ooh, stuff's already starting to fall over. Then I also picked up this. This is the Tarte, oh my gosh, what is wrong with my nose? The Tarte High Performance Naturals Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. It does have SPF 15. I have been looking at this foundation for months and debating on whether or not to get it and I finally just gave in. I was like, forget it. I've been looking at it. Tired of wondering about it. I have to have it. And I do not regret it at all. This is it. Comes in like a little squeeze tube. I know some people don't like that. Some people um, prefer foundation with a pump on it. I love this. I don't mind it. This is a 12 hour makeup. It's full coverage and it's matte. Really dry skin people, I don't know if you'd like this, but oily like me, I mean, I am super, super oily. This is amazing. I mean, this is right up there with my Estee Lauder Double Wear. Right now, I couldn't tell you which one I love more. I love, love, love this. I am in the shade Fair Sand. Um, and that's another thing I like about this is they have so many shade options like it actually kind of threw me for a little bit like I didn't even know if I got the right shade but it actually turned out to be perfect so highly recommend this let's see what else is down here in my bag of tricks 
Okay, I'm gonna go and get these out of the way. Um, I got, is that everything I got? Yes, okay, I got six of the new NYX um, liquid suede cream lipsticks. I am going to have a swatch video of these. Either it's up now or it will be up. Um, but I plan on doing a swatch video of all of these. These are amazing. The only thing is they're not really long wearing. So if you're looking for a longer wear lipstick, this isn't really going to give it to you. It's a very unique formula. And the fact that they don't dry down like a liquid lipstick to where it's like matte. They almost kind of stay in a cream formula and they wipe off really easily. They don't stain your lips or anything. So they're unique, but I do love them. So look out for that video if you're interested about this. Um, I picked up another one of these. I ran out, so I decided to go ahead and get another one. This is the Maybelline um, Instant Age Rewind and I have the shade Fair. Love this stuff. Great, great drugstore concealer. Oh, and I also got um, three more NYX uh, little lippies. Got these here. This one is, this is the NYX Simply Nude Lip Cream in Fairest. Do a little swatch here for you. That's it there. And then I got this other nude one. And to be honest, they look kind of the same. This one is, I'm sorry if I'm kind of sitting off to the side. I've got stuff in my chair here. Um, this one is in shade Peaches. They're really, really close. One has more of a peach, one has more of a pink undertone. I don't know, one of them might go back because they're so close. They look different online, but seeing them in person, I'm not really sure. But I love this one. This one is the Simply Vamp Lip Cream in Temptress. Mm, it's beautiful 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 purple love it and i love that it's a dark purple when i got it and i saw the tube i didn't want it to be like a you know barney purple um okay here's another lippy this is the new i need some water the new maybelline color blur in the shade what are you plum hmm? plum please now the concept behind these is a little weird. First of all, when you open it, I wanna do this to get the product out of the tube, but you actually twist the little end and the product comes up. Um, that's the shade. It's a beautiful, beautiful shade. Super pigmented. It's a little more red than I was expecting. I wanted it to be more plum, but nonetheless, it is beautiful. But, twist it back down. On the end, it comes with like this little, you can tell I've used it, but like this little silicone smudger and you're supposed to like blur it out. I don't really, um, I don't really get it. I tried doing it that way. I just wear it as normal. I don't really use a little blurrer stick. Okay, then another lippy. I was on a lippy haul, y'all. Um, this is by ColourPop. And this is their, um, what is their, what are they called? They're the liquid lipsticks, the liquid matte, what are you called? Ultra Matte Lip in Trap. You guys, you guys, everyone and their mama needs this lipstick. This is probably the most perfect lipstick I have ever used in my life. Yes, you heard it here first. It's perfect. Everything about it. That's the shade there. It is amazing from the color to the way it wears on your lips. This is the first ever long wearing lipstick that I have actually worn for a long time, if that makes sense. I'm a weirdo in the fact that I don't like lipstick on my lips for a long time. I have high maintenance lips and they get all goopy and funky and I hate it and I gotta wipe things off. I kept this on for about seven hours. It did not crack, it did not chip, it did not make my lips funky. The color still looked just like this on my lips. I was so impressed. I literally want every single one of these, but I definitely need a lifetime supply of this. 
This is in the shade Trap, and you need to run out and get it. Then, oh, I got a blush from MAC. This is in the shade Pink Cult. And this is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful color. Now, it does kind of throw me a little bit because it looks like a muted, mauve plum shade. That's it there. But on the cheeks, and it could just be my skin tone, it comes off very pink. I mean, it is called Pink Cult. So it's a little tricky. Um, I'm still playing around with it. I don't know, but I do like it. Um, okay, so I got this little sample. This is the Lorac Alter Ego Gloss in Goddess. I already have the lipstick, so I got the little gloss. Let's see. I haven't opened this yet. Oh, that smells good. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. There. You guys, if you don't own Goddess, you need that too. Amazing. So I'm happy to have the lip gloss to go along with the lipstick. And I need to wipe some of these swatches off my... Make room for more. You see, that trap is not coming off, y'all. Okay, what else we got? Uh, I got another concealer. This is the NYX HD Concealer. Amazing, amazing um, drugstore concealer. I have the lightest shade. I think it's uh, porcelain. Yeah, porcelain. Then, let me just go ahead and get these out of the way. With my Becca purchase, I got... Um, these four things from Becca. I got a opal um, shimmering skin perfector in the poured. So it's like a cream um, skin perfector in the shade opal. And then I also got the, um, the powder opal. So that was a nice gift. And then it also came with these two things, the Becca Ever Matte Poreless Priming Perfector and the Becca Luminous Body Perfecting Mousse. So very excited to try those. And I also picked up a blush. I got a blush from Cargo and this is in the shade Big Easy. I love Cargo's packaging. I think these little tins are so cute. Um, so that's what it looks like and they're huge you get so much in here but you guys look at that color is that not beautiful um so this is shade big easy that's it there <gasps> i love it that swatched on my hand there in the middle love 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 this blush and Big Easy, I think I said that. I'm not gonna list everything down below because I'd be there all day. So I'm trying to make sure I tell you the names of everything several times. Okay, then I got two more um, L'Oreal Infallible eyeshadows. I love these if you don't already know. So I picked up two more. This is in Gilded Envy. Love it. I think it was Tati um, that recently showed this. And as soon as she showed it, I knew I had to have it. That's it there. It's almost like a taupey green gold. I just love it. So that's Gilded Envy. And then I got Golden Sage. And this one is like your true um, bright green. I mean, look at that. Look at that. That's it there. It's just beautiful. I mean, these shadows are amazing. I seriously want them in every shade. All right, let me wipe some of this off. Oh. Run out of space here. Okay, what else is in here? Okay, um, ColourPop, something else from ColourPop. I got this ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in Millionaire. Um, this is also in my giveaway because I love it so much. Beautiful. I mean, come on, come on. Is that not fabulous? Love it. So just got that to add to my growing ColourPop collection. 
Then, okay, then I just got a bunch of um, samples. Oh, I did get this. With my Tarte purchase, I got this. There's a, what are you? Oh, dropping stuff. Oh, oh, gosh, oh, oh too old. Um, it's a Deluxe Opening Act Lash Primer and a Deluxe Lip Surgeon's Lip Cream in Pristine. I did swatch this earlier and I wasn't really happy with the shade, um, but I'll just show you. It's a little too um, pink for me. That's it there. But I do love these. They smell like mint and I love that in a lip product when it smells like mint. So that's that. I got that one I purchased. And then I got all these samples um, with everything I bought. I got a Hyaluronic Eye Cream from Mario Bescu. I got a Carol's Daughter Sulfite Free Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, crack uh, Shampoo and Conditioner. Yes, it is called Crack. I have used this before. Um, a Hask Macadamia Oil Shampoo and Conditioner. A, a Ahava Bright Nights Age Control Brightening and Renewal Serum. Another one of those. Two poor professional um, primers. You know, I've never tried that, so I'm very excited to try that. Um, another Mario Badescu Aloe Moisturizer. Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I mean, how many of these can a girl have? A million. Then I have the Lumine. Finland Time Freeze Instant Lift Serum. So be on the lookout for those. I do do like a sample video of everything I've sampled and if I like it. Now, my most favorite thing ever. Oh, let me get this out of the way. Also with my L'Oreal purchase, I got this. I'm um, like little goodie bag. And in here's like some coupons. Um, this nice size of their sulfate free, ever strong thickening shampoo and conditioner. I love this stuff. Um, then also some samples of their Smooth Intense Shampoo, Conditioner, and what is that? Pre-conditioner? Shampoo, pre-conditioner, and a conditioner? Well, what the heck does a pre-conditioner do? I guess we'll find out. Um, and some other things like their Revitalift, um, and a coupon for some True Match, which I don't like for I. So, yeah, got that. Now. You guys, I have been ordering crap from NYX for I don't know how long, and I love when they give away, like, with your $100 purchase, you get this gift bag full of goodies, but you guys, this one takes the cake. I placed a $100 order just to get this. This is free. Everything in here was free. The bag was free. I'm just gonna quickly, I know I've been sitting here talking for, how long have I been talking to y'all? 20 minutes. I'm probably gonna be here for another 10 showing you everything here because I'm just blown away. So keep your eye out for when they do this. Okay, very quickly. This huge set of shampoo and conditioner, this is a Travel Valet Blonde Shell Keratin Complex Shampoo and Conditioner. You get some coupons. You get a full-size Revlon Color Burst Lip Lacquer in shade. Peel off this because I'm going to swatch it. Um, I have used this already. I love it. What is the shade? What is the shade? Oh, I need glasses. Whimsical. I love these, again, because they smell like mint. There's the shade there. It's perfection. Um, you get a Benefit Their Real Push-Up Liner. I've never tried that. Excited to try that. Um, you get this huge deluxe sample size of the Living Proof Nourishing Styling Cream. You get an It Cosmetics Hello Lashes Mascara. You get a Strivectin Advanced Retinal Eye Treatment. A Vita Bath Cupcake Couture Dreamy Pink Frosting body wash. Ooh, I'm going to smell this. Stop it, Oreo. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's nice. Then you get a Reveal Calvin Klein perfume. Oh, look how cute. Oh, you guys, I mean, that is not your typical little 
thingamabob. It's nice. Okay. Um, it's a tin miracle leave-in light. This is, it says, does 10 things instantly, enhances, enhances, enhances natural body, weightless detangler, adds silkiness, adds shine, humidity resistant, color protector, prevents split ends, eliminates frizz, thermal protector, environmental protection. Excited to try that. And that, I think that's a full size. Um, another Tarte Lip Surgeons. This one is like the other one I got. Not too crazy about the color. It's it there. Love the smell. Um, then an H2O oil-free marine hydration hydrating treatment. Oh, is this for your hair or for your face? Face. A cute little bottle of one of my favorite all-time products, the Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. Love that. I have gotten one of these before and I loved it so much. I bought the bottle. This is by Ulta. This is their Sweet Fantasy um, Body Lotion in Vanilla and Caramel. I've mentioned this before. Look, ooh, my hair's looking crazy. I love this not necessarily for the moisturizing properties, but because the smell lasts all day. Um, then I got a Lorac Pro fiber mascara a Ulta Beauty deep treatment foaming mask well that's weird a foaming mask apply liberally to wet skin leave on two to three minutes splash with water and gently massage into a lather rinse with warm water well that should be interesting I love a good mask then I got by pure dirty girl detoxifying mud mask Pure is an excellent brand. Love the name. Can't wait to try that. And a few more things. Again, with these Smashbox primer samples. Jeez. You'd never have to buy that. Literally. Then, um, what is this? Oh, an Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. Hello. And last but not least, Gucci Guilty. I'm assuming this is perfume. Let's see? Yes! How cute is that? Oh gosh! I was expecting it to have like a little spray and it doesn't, so be careful. So, how amazing is that? And you get this nice bag with little wristlets. Oh, love it! So, I hope you enjoyed this haul. If there is anything in here that piques your interest that you're curious about or you want me to try do a review on comment down below and let me know make sure you are entered in my giveaway link is down below and i hope you have a great day and i hope you made it through the end of this video if you did give me a thumbs up bye